the gifting season. And what better, more cost-effective gift to give to that special lady than the gift of music, in the style of Kuko, who is a music maker based in LA who can sing in English and song in Spanish. Okay, let's music. La music. In order to make la music, you're probably gonna want to start off with your composition. Because if you don't start off with your composition, it means you hate yourself, and you don't want to hate yourself today, not today. Not right now. So for the tempo, you're gonna want to keep it anywhere from 80 to 100 BPM. Keep it slow, it's gonna be a slow ride, it's gonna be vibey, it's gonna have a lot of- All right, it's time, time. And for the time, you just stick to 4-4. Four, four. Time. So for the key, what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna want to go to your circle of fifths and then just close your eyes and throw it, see where it lands. Let destiny make a choice, you know? All right, so it looks like we got an A flat. Great, you got your composition, and now we need some synth chords, which means we first have to get lost in the wonderful world of sounds. So the first thing you, you pick is the preset. It's called a knit. It's pretty sick. Uh, oscillator A, unison 4, and then detune a little bit, and then blend it up. Then the envelope, uh, the attack, super small, and then decay 790, and then uh, sustain. Uh, you lower it a little bit, 3.6, and then the release is 552 milliseconds, and the filter, low 12, the, uh, the envelope, you send it to the cutoff, and then the cutoff is actually at 150 hertz, and then the resonance is 33%, and the effects, oh god, the effects, the hyper dimension, that sounds cool. Phaser pressing the filter open. The, the, the low six Great, now that you've got your synths, plug them into your MIDI controller and play a bunch of seventh chords. Ah, that's nice. Now for the lead synth. I'm just get a preset for this one, you don't know what you're doing. That's not All right, for the drums, you're gonna want to uh, get a nice sample pack from uh, Mexican uh, general stores. You got a great selection of sounds, such as la pera, which is a sample of a pear. We got sounds such as el kick, el snare, and uh, la highest of hats. So for the bass, you're just gonna need to pluck this with the... the put everything together. Hey, good job. Now you're a producer. Lost vocals. Writing lyrics is a lot like taking a long trip to the bathroom. It's private, relieving, and borderline bloody. But before you go and clog your mind heart, you need to know how to write a chorus and how to write a verse. So check out these thumbs. Chorus catchy, verse not so catchy. Once you know how to write your things, now you're gonna need a cheesy theme. You know, stuff like uh, like how even though this is a gift, she's the gift, you know? Or, you know, like, why she's so sad. You gotta come up with something cheesy yet meaningful, you know? Meaningful cheese. Okay, now just go lock yourself in the little writer's room and start churning out some lyrics. Once you've finished writing your lyrics, it's time to set up your recording booth. So grab those extra thick ethnic blankets with the tigers and shit for soundproofing and light up your conceita candle to ward off the bad vibes. Then just sing along to the melody. Don't look sad. And flip that English to Spanish switch accordingly. When you're done, you just export it into your phone. You just really go and make sure you export it directly into your phone, and then everything should be going fine. Hey, look at me, I'm a rapper. All right, so now that you got a nice and pack, a nice and packaged for the holidays, let's go ahead and deliver this baby. I wrote this song for my mom. This is my canción. Happy birthday. We went to breakfast one morning, and at one point, I saw her looking out the window. She was looking at nothing in particular, but the way she was looking pricked me as particular. Here she was, wearing these sad eyes, lethargic eyes, eyes that pierced at nothing except me when I looked at them. She wouldn't tell me what was wrong when I asked and I couldn't stop thinking about it. The thought tugged at my heart and snapped back with a feeling of agonizing helplessness. To see her like that and feeling like I could do nothing, I just wanted to fix it, just wanted to make her happy. 
but all I could do was express this, perhaps in a curious hope that wondered if the lethargic could turn cathartic. Maybe it would make her happy, even if it might make her sad at first. This episode is brought to you by Skillshare. Skillshare is an online learning community with over 20,000 classes in design, music, technology, and so much more. Premium membership gives you unlimited access to high quality classes on must know topics so you can improve your skills, unlock new opportunities, and do the work you love. If you're into music like me, I suggest you try a course called Music Theory for Electronic Musicians taught by Jason Allen. This one's great for learning the fundamentals of music theory so that you can immediately apply them in your production. Things such as triads, progressions, and ways to make them more interesting. So join the millions of students already learning on Skillshare today with a special offer just for my subscribers. You get two months of Skillshare for free. To sign up, visit the link in the description and get two months of unlimited access to over 20,000 classes for free. Act now for this special offer and start learning today. Don't look sad.